The HeadSmart 2 study is the first of its kind to broadly investigate whether biomarkers in the blood can lead to more accurate diagnosis and treatment of mild traumatic brain injuries, commonly known as concussions. I think the surprising piece that when I talk to not only patients, but the community about the type of research we're doing is most people don't know that it hasn't been solved yet. I actually have had some close friends that have had some pretty serious complications from having really bad concussions or multiple concussions. And one of the ways that we're diagnosing some of these mild traumatic brain injuries is through CT scans. I'm gonna place you into the scanner now. Your job is just to stay super still. But in about 90% of patients, that CT scan is normal. And it becomes a waiting game to see, are they gonna have symptoms short-term, long-term. Patients who come to Carilion Roanoke Memorial's emergency department for concussion treatment are asked to participate in the study. In addition to taking blood samples, clinical research coordinator Daniela Rodriguez asks patients to take some simple cognitive tests. I think that participating in research is really important. We don't get to find out about these discoveries without the help of the community. Patients absolutely benefit from research because an institution's focus is on what is best for the patient and that may be something in the future. This study is in collaboration with Brain Box Solutions in Richmond. Brain research that started at Carilion has expanded to other locations nationally and internationally. We're kind of at the frontier of a lot of really incredible discoveries um, and I think that it's really important to keep pushing that frontier and to keep trying to continue to improve patient care. I think everybody who hears about it is very excited for the future. I know I am.